This is the future. Good morning guys, so my metal sheeting arrived a few days ago and I only have today to put them on. So I packed out the roof to see what the size is and exactly how much overhang I have and I'm pleased to say I've got about 205, 2.5, um, 250 millimeter or 2.5 centimeter overhang right around so uh, let's get the plates to the back here we go guys the roof is up it's overlapping the same all the way through um, I actually walked on top of the roof and I'm happy to say I didn't fall through all my screws are right in the in the beams I need them to be um, quite happy with the result. This roof isn't going anywhere. This thing is tight, tight, tight. This thing is down. Yay, we're done! Now I can put my lights, electrical plugs, my uh, sorry, focus, my cabinets, and everything. I'm so glad it's finished. And here we go. It's stats time. For those of you guys who like to see stats, let's see. Carbolinium. I used 11 liters of carbolinium. All the screws, the amount of screws that went into the construction of various sizes, 1095 screws. The amount of wood length that I used is 282.9 meters of various sizes of different wood. And lastly, the price. So you guys remember the cheapest one was 6,800. The most expensive one was 12,500. I spent 7,155 for the wood, 1,124 for the screws and other stuff, which gives you a total of 8,279 Rand. Was it worth it? I think so. Sure, it's not um, uh, as cheap as I wanted it to be, but it's something that I did myself. I built this thing myself, it's built the way that I wanted to, and I think I like the way it turned out. I've had people that show, told me, hey, show me what it looks like, and I show them a picture, and they go like, what the hell? I didn't expect this from you. I thought you're just gonna build a counter and a couple of shelves. I didn't expect you to build an entire building which just goes to show how much I'm underestimated. But I'm happy with my place and I'm happy with the way it turned out. So guys, at the end of the day, I just want to say three things. If you want something done, do it yourself. Don't let anyone tell you that you are unrealistic or impractical or that you cannot do something. If you really put your mind to it and you really want to do something, you can do it. And then lastly, enjoy your social areas. Enjoy the places that you've created for yourself where you can invite friends and people over to enjoy the social experience. Because I definitely am. So guys, thank you very much for watching this video and watching the whole series. I hope you like what I've done. So if you do like what I've done here and what you see, give me a thumbs up. And remember to subscribe to this channel and to hit that bell icon if you want to get notified of the next video which will be the replacement of a crank seal on a Toyota Runix. And then until next time guys, remember whatever you do, keep it safe. Cheers.